Lu Jane is not free. She's just been uh, temporarily released, conditionally released. And uh, what we want um, now is that real justice. Women emp empowerment is uh, a a lie in Saudi Arabia that there are no uh, real uh, reforms. Um, I mean, again, I'll give some examples. Uh, women are, tra are allowed to travel now without the consent of their male guardian, but it's only the consent that is needed before traveling. But if a woman decides to, to travel and the male guardian uh, thinks it's um, uh, disobeding him or that uh, it's a disappearance, then he can call the police and imprison her. Yes, as a reformer, I think we could uh, believe it at the beginning because we didn't really know who he, who, who he was. Uh, but now that it's been years um, that he's been um, doing crime after crime without anyone uh, putting pressure on him to, to stop this, I think um, it's only about his image, you know. Uh, everything he's doing is for his image and to be legitimate, um, to be the one uh, the, the West chooses, basically. Of course, Saudi Arabia's uh... Uh, situation is tightly connected to what's going on in the uh, US. So, I mean, it is a fact that Lujain was in prison during uh, the previous administration and it was really hard to, to get anything. And it is a fact that she was released few days, few weeks after Biden's arrival to power. And I, uh, I have to say, yes, uh, without international pressure, we cannot obtain something.